hello 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 welcome back to my channel it is color me badly back with a review for all of my oud lovers out there i got something for you but before we get into that i want to welcome you back to my channel welcome back i hope all is well i hope everyone had a blessed a blessed and safe holiday weekend i know for some they had three and four day weekends so i hope you partied hard and strong in a safe way all right so without further ado i want to go into the fragrance that i want to share with you all this fragrance is gorgeous long lasting oody rosy you guessed it it is club de nuit and tonts by arma for women this fragrance is absolutely gorgeous and i want to come on and share that this fragrance with you uh, I love it. I have yet to wear it outside the house. I have tested it inside the house. And all I can tell you is. So let me show you the bottle. And of course, I do have the um, Club de Nuit for Women, uh, which that one, this one has been compared to Mademoiselle by Coco Chanel. I am a Coco Chanel girl. It has similarities to it, but I wouldn't say that this is a duplicate for that. But some people do, and so I won't argue with them, but definitely I wanted to put them together. But this fragrance is totally different. Uh, this bottle, I'll bring it in a little bit closer so you can actually see it. It is a rosy, fresh, spicy, warm, spicy, patchouli, vanilla, oud woody floral amber and powdery this fragrance is absolutely gorgeous now i don't want to waste a lot of my juice but i'm gonna pop the top you guys know how much i absolutely love these fragrance bottles and the tops they have a little bit of a magnetic force to them when you drop them down they kind of automatically kind of sit on the top there i absolutely love that you've got the the bling bling on the cube there then on the top of the itemizer, it shows the house of the fragrance, which is our moth. It's in gold. And I'm going to spray a little bit of this. The detail is so gorgeous on this fragrance. I absolutely love it. I'm going to spray a little bit. I already have some on, but I'm going to spray a little bit more so you guys can see the, the itemizer on the spray. Beautiful, beautiful fragrance. Now, this is not for the soft fragrance lover. Um, the sweet soft skin scent type of fragrance this fragrance is loud boastful it is in charge I think this would be a beautiful fragrance to wear if you have a PowerPoint presentation and you want to smell good and feel strong about your presentation that would be a perfect fragrance for you it could be an evening out fragrance as well but spray lightly spray lightly um, the top notes of this fragrance are rose it's a pink rose saffron geranium nutmeg pepper violet caraway patchouli vanilla agarwood oud and amber and when I say, ooh, you got to be in the mood for it because it is oody. This fragrance is gorgeous. If you are not a lover of oud, if you are not familiar with oud, um, if you're not a fan of deep, intense, sensual, sexy, erotic fragrances, this is not the fragrance for you. This is strong, long-lasting. It creates a beautiful scent bubble. Um, it creates a beautiful scent trail. And you can smell this if you spray your clothing you will be able to smell this for days and days and days and so if you're a person that likes to wear jackets and blazers and you don't put them in the, the dry cleaner or wash them right away you may not want to spray your garments because wherever you place that garment you are going to spill that fragrance until you clean it it is that strong and that potent i want to give you a little bit of information about this fragrance just to see if I can find a little bit of notation on it to tell you a little bit about it. Well, actually, there are some reviews that I found that were pretty good. 
But most of all, I've seen reviews that love the fragrance. They like the fragrance. It is recommended as a winter fragrance, slightly springtime, uh, fall. It is definitely an evening fragrance. But like I said, if you have a PowerPoint presentation and you need a little bit of an extra confidence, I would highly recommend using this fragrance uh, as your PowerPoint scent. Let me grab this bottle again while she's dying down. It's heavy too, ladies. And you know what? And I'm going to be honest with you. This fragrance can be worn by a gentleman. I would love to smell this on a fine gentleman. And I'm going to tell you because it's got the fragrances where it could be qualified as a unisex fragrance. Now, there is a Club de Nuit for men that comes in an all black bottle. So where you see the gold medallion and the gold cap, the men's version of this comes in all black um, but I definitely a man could wear this um, some would say that this kind of reminds them of Mademoiselle as the uh, original Club de Nuit does it has a few of the notes and similarities of Mademoiselle but I honestly believe that Mademoiselle is a fragrance all of its own I don't like to compare anything to the elaborate House of Chanel fragrances. There are some similarities, but this fragrance definitely, definitely stands alone. So I'll bring it in a little bit closer and I'll go ahead and read to you some information about this fragrance. Again, this fragrance is called Club de Nuit by Armoff. It is a cypher floral fragrance for women. But again, I, I could smell this on a gentleman. I'm telling you, I could. Top notes are rose, saffron, geranium. Your middle or your heart notes are nutmeg, pepper, violet, caraway, base notes are patchouli, vanilla, agarwood, oud, and amber. I'm gonna. I'm here to tell you this fragrance is absolutely gorgeous. Let me kind of wipe it down a little bit. I got fingerprints all on my you can really see fingerprints uh, on metallic and all black bottles I tell you so let's yeah that looks so much better the cap has still got a lot of fingerprints on it I, I've been playing in it today but this fragrance is absolutely gorgeous absolutely gorgeous um, if the gentleman in your life likes to wear a strong bold boastful fragrance definitely definitely this would be a beautiful companion with whatever he is wearing. I also wanted to share, I took some notes here on some of the fragrances that this particular fragrance has been compared to. Um, this fragrance has been compared to Tom Ford's Black Orchid, uh, Tom Ville's Tobacco Vanille, uh, Dior's Dior Home, and Tense 2011 and Mugler's Angel Muse. Now, I have a couple of those fragrances that were listed. The, I wouldn't compare this. This fragrance doesn't remind me of anything other than itself and then also its companion. So that is what I would say. These two are similar. If you like this or you love this, you would definitely, definitely like the Intense. It is deeper. It's richer. It's more sensuous. As if you could make this more of a sexier fragrance because this girl is a beast but they intensify all of the aromatics of this fragrance they loaded up on the oud and the patchouli they gave us a little bit of a rose and figured out how to make this beautiful fragrance a gourmand so this will be considered a rosy gourmand fragrance absolutely beautiful so if you love rose if you love amber if you love patchouli if you like caraway, saffron, geranium, nutmeg, a little bit of pepper for a soft, spicy, and warm, spicy at the same time fragrance. And if you like vanilla with the amber and oudy dry down, Club de Nuit Intense for Women by Armoff would be the fragrance for you. If you have this fragrance and you enjoy this fragrance, comment below and let me know what you pair it with. If you have this fragrance and you've yet to try it, share that with me as well. If you've never heard of it, whatever the case may be, comment below or send me an email about this beautiful, beautiful luxury fragrance. It is absolutely gorgeous. 
this will always be a mainstay in my collection i love 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 this fragrance it is gorgeous i didn't think i was gonna like it but when i tell you this bad girl works 24 7 you can take this from work to the ballroom to you know where else it will handle business for you so if you don't have this fragrance in your collection and you are looking for a deep sultry oody rosy gourmand fragrance that is intense deeper than the deepest deep try club de nuit intense by our moth and you know what i always say get you some all right ladies all of my ood lovers out there i thank you welcome back again to my channel thank you for visiting thank you for watching this is color me bad lynn saying bye for now god bless guys peace